What's up you guys, Sydney Morgan here and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am so glad that you are here today. And as you can see, we have a special guest. She's I'm making back. a return. She's <laughs> back for more. Part one got lots of love and y'all wanted to see her recreate another one of my looks. So that is exactly what we're going to be doing today. I posted a little question bubble on my Instagram story and asked you guys which one of my looks she should recreate and a and an answer that we received a lot was this rainbow butterfly look. And this look is from a long time ago. Yeah, if you guys want to see her recreate this look, then keep on watching. Okay, awesome. And I realized I didn't show you guys the picture of the look that she's recreating. So this one, this one right here. If you're an OG, then you'll remember it. Let's get started. Soup of the day. Serving it up Gary's, Gary's way. way. Here's what I will be using today. Same as last time, nothing new here. No, you used eyeshadow last time, this is face paint. I used face paint in the last one? I guess a little bit, yeah. Do I, wait, is there makeup on you in this one too, or is it just paint? Um, I think Roll the clip, I, find the picture. Right there, what, what's the date of that? September 18th, so that was a long time ago. This one's gonna be tough, I'm excited to see how it turns out. I'm nervous. We got questions today or no? Yeah, I got some questions from online. It's gonna be more of like this or that type questions or would you rather, and you can use whatever brushes you want, but I'm not gonna correct you. I'm just gonna, you know, let you do okay. what you want. You went Roy G. Biv. Roy G. Biv. Okay, where's your paint? What are the colors of Roy G. Biv go? Red, orange, yellow, Roy G. Green, blue, what's the eye? I thought it was purple. Indigo, violet. <laughs> yeah, there you so go. I was like, what? What's the eye? What color is indigo? Like navy, I think. Is it? Indigo. Indigo. Is it like this? Yeah. See, it's like blue, bluish purple. Oh, I like that blue. Yeah, it's cute. Also, guys, if you were thinking to yourself, dang, Sid, you look kind of greasy today. Um. I just got my hair dyed and I got it dyed darker and I'm scared to wash it because I don't want the color to come out. So I haven't washed it in like two or three days. So just, if, you, if you're thinking that I look greasy, just just ignore that. All right, first step, I'm gonna do, it doesn't look like you have much red in here. Mm -hmm. Looks more pink orangey. So I think I'm gonna start mm -hmm. off with this pink. I don't even know. So what's the strategy here? I'm gonna just go in with the color first. Do a little bit of blending. Um, oh, all right, we're gonna go through a list of rapid fire would you rather questions. Oh gosh, here we go. Okay. Would you rather be able to fly or be invisible? This wind is honestly disrespectful. I know. Uh, definitely fly. Yeah, cause I mean, I feel like being invisible is like low key dumb. Cause like, what would you do? Okay, next. Would you rather never use social media again or never watch another movie or TV show. Never watch another movie or TV show, I don't really. What about you? I mean, I have to say never watch another movie or TV show because social media is like my, my like, I, I can't get it's like my pride and joy. So. Next, would you rather always be surrounded by annoying people or be alone for the rest of your life? Annoying people or alone? I literally am so scared to be alone, so I, not even, like, I don't know, actually. Just think of who annoys you the most in this world and then just put like everyone, everyone that you've ever come in contact with is gonna make like you feel like that person. I think I'd still rather be surrounded by annoying people. I yeah. don't know. I'd be so bored by myself. Definitely same. Like I, I, Cause I, I get so bored. Like I just get so bored. I feel like I'm I'd be able to re relate to annoying people anyways. So like we'd have a good time. Yeah. Would you rather lose all your money and valuables or lose all the pictures that you've ever taken? I don't know. That's hard. I guess I'd rather lose all the pictures I've ever taken. I see, like, I don't think I could do that. That's I don't know. so sad. But then you're more of, like, living in the moment because you're not just, like, okay, doing Okay, yeah, right. Like and plus, like, you kind of need money to live. Yeah. If you lost all your money, like... Mm. I mean, I guess you could make more. But, like, your value like, starting too. completely over. Like, does that... Is, is your house a valuable? Like, are you losing your house? I, yeah. I'd say yeah, so. I, but I don't think I could lose my house. Because <laughs> you'd be for the streets. I'd be for the streets. You'd literally be for the streets. I'm not for the streets. They scare me. I'm more of a sidewalk girl. I'm pretty sure you're getting this in my eye. Oh, it's definitely getting in your eye. <laughs> Stop looking at it. You're not allowed to look. Okay. Would you rather die in... <laughs> okay. Would you rather die in 50 years with lots of regrets or die in 20 years with no regrets? Die in 20 years with no regrets. Honestly, same. I don't care how old I live. 
Yeah, you, I'd rather be here for a good time, not a long time. Yeah. <laughs> Period. Period. Would you rather have a head the size of a watermelon or have a head the size of a tennis ball? Mm. I feel like I would be really insecure if I had a watermelon head. <laughs> I think I'd prefer the smaller head. No, see, I would Because then no one would be able to tell like if my nose is uneven. But listen, I'm crazy. listen, like, I'd, I'd rather have a watermelon head because then there's more room to do face paint on myself. If I had like a big watermelon head, like imagine, like I could do like a whole mural. Would you rather never be able to take an airplane again or never have internet access again? Oh my gosh, like imagine driving to California. Or like, you wouldn't be able to leave North America. Take a freaking Yeah, you'd have boat. to take a boat. Take a, do people take boats, bro? I won't even get on a cruise ship. Like, but yeah, you could have look stuff up. Ever. Why? That's the internet. Well, like, we don't have, what do you mean? Like, like you could not use the internet. Like, I couldn't use Safari? No. Or Instagram or anything? Or Google Chrome. <laughs> okay, last one. Would you rather be a wizard or a vampire? Probably a wizard because Definitely I don't like blood. A wizard. I don't like blood. Definitely a wizard. I thought about it because of Twilight. I was like, oh. yeah, but I couldn't. But Alex Russo, about <laughs> Wizards of Waverly Place. That show is so fire. I like the way that she kept her wizard wand in her boot. Like I always wanted to do that. So now what are you doing? I'm gonna blend some green in. Getting there. Now we're gonna answer some like more likely to questions. Like out of us two, who would be most likely to do to blah, blah, blah. So out of us two, who would be like most likely to do these things? You're so focused. Uh, it literally like looks pretty even. And that's, I'm like shocked. Who's the better driver? You. Definitely me. Who studied the hardest in school? I think you did. Honestly, like yeah. whenever you, like you were in school. Like I, I don't think I've ever. Hard. I don't do it. Like now I I probably do like barely. And for what? And for what? Literally for what? And for what? What? Where did that get you? <sighs> I'm TikTok a TikToker. Thing. I'm a TikToker. I'm a TikToker. So. AP Biology really helped me out to form this butterfly look on my <laughs> face. I I knew where the um the body parts are. Who is more creative? <sighs> oh my god, like, that's a hard one. <laughs> like probably you. <laughs> like probably me. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't, I've always been creative. I don't know. It's just isn't it a thing like. If you're like left brained or something, you're more creative. And know. if you're right brained, you're more like practical. I have no idea. I think there's a thing. I don't know which side is which, but I think there's like a study. Who's better at cooking? Me. You think so? Yes. Yeah. I'm good at like baking too. I like always wanted you to like be a baker. I'm like, I, 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 I was really good school. for like over quarantine. I was like Gordon Ramsay. No, I really wanted you to go to culinary school and like open like a bakery. <laughs> for what? Like where? That's so cool. I'm getting ripped tonight. R.I.P. that. Hey. <laughs> okay. Continue the questions. I'm gonna take a break for a minute while this dries. Who's more adventurous? Um, I feel like we both kind of are. Yeah. Like in our own ways. I've been a lot of. Well, not, I wouldn't say a lot of places, but like I, like, and I have a lot of plans to do other things too. Yep, but not during a panorama. Not during a panorama. Not during a Panda Express. Didn't do that. Didn't go anywhere. Mm -mm. Who's messier? Definitely me. Probably you, yeah. Definitely I mean, me. No, I'm a hot mess everywhere. You're a hot mess express. It's true. My friend's private story is named the Hot Mess Express. Really? Shut up the camera. What's yours named? Live from the streets. I'm just batty Maciak. <laughs> I love like people's private story names. Somebody's private story was named um, All Panic No Disco and I <laughs> thought that was so funny. Was I want a new name for my private story so if you guys have any suggestions on what I should name my private Snapchat story, leave them in the comments down below. And if you don't have me on Snapchat, it's the same as my Instagram. Sydney.Morgan, but the only Morgan is a zero, so follow me on Instagram and add me on Snapchat. If you're in a room full <laughs> of every boy you've ever talked to, do you know which one you would go to? I would run to Charlie Puth. <laughs> Who? <laughs> oh wait, someone told me I look like him and I literally <laughs> couldn't sleep that night. <laughs> I couldn't sleep that night. Someone told me I look like John Cena. <laughs> I read that comment on TikTok and then I looked it up and I'm like, do I really? That's horrible. I'm like, how do they know what he looks like? Cause you can't see him. Cause you can't see me, dog. Yeah. <laughs> Did you shush me? I can't concentrate if you're blabbing in my, in my face. <laughs> blabbing in my face. <laughs> Alright, shh. Alright, ready? You gotta quiet down. <laughs> Where are you, librarian? <laughs> quiet down. It looks so good. 
doesn't. Like if someone was scared of butterflies, like this is what they I'm would see in their nightmares. I'm scared of butterflies. You're scared of moths. I know you're scared of moths. You're I heard like, butterflies too. I was like home alone one night and there I know there was a moth in our house somewhere and I didn't know where it was so I literally like locked myself in my room and I like could not sleep because I knew there was a moth in our house. And I won't even like squish the moths either or like put them outside or anything. I'll put like a cup. Like I'll literally get like a that's cup. What, that's what means we do with our stink bugs. And I'll put it on top of it if I can like find it. We have a contraption in our apartment you might want to invest in. Okay. So it's a piece of styrofoam, I think a piece of cardboard, and then a cup. And we trap the stink bug in it until we can either take it outside or... Yeah, I, I, we, they like crawl through our vents. It's like disgusting. I've like, I haven't seen them since I was like... That's not, not the only creature that crawls through your vents. <gasps> we had a bat. We had a bat on Valentine's Day. They had a bat It was in literally the scariest thing I think I've ever seen in my entire life. We did like call our friends to like come and get it out, but it was literally the scariest thing I think I've ever seen. Like the worst Valentine's Day I've ever had. You look like angry because the way I like pointed that one in. <laughs> <laughs> look like so mad. Okay, ready? I'm gonna rapid fire you okay. like this or that question. So you just don't think about it. Whichever one comes to your head first, just do it. Netflix or YouTube? YouTube. Music or movies? Music. Shoes or soap? Shoes. Sunscreen or sunglasses? Sunglasses. Sugar or gluten? Sugar. Car or phone? Phone. Coffee or alcohol? Coffee. The beach or the snow? Beach. Toilet paper, toothbrush? Brush. Fruits, vegetables. Um, fruits. Last one. Pillow or blanket? Blanket. Okay. Ding ding ding. What about you? How do you feel about that? I'll do you. All right. Mascara or eyeliner? Mascara. Bright or natural look? Ah, Hurry. natural. Lipstick or lip gloss? Lip gloss. Yeah. Blush or highlight? Blush. Foundation or powder? Foundation. Eye curler or eyelashes? Like. Um, curler, I guess. Mm. Face mist or serum? A uh, serum. Brushes or sponges? Brushes. Yeah, I know that. Eyeshadow or bronzer? Eyeshadow. Sunblock or moisturizer? Moisturizer? Or right, but your moisturizer should have SPF in it. Yeah, there you go. Mask or scrub? Oh, uh, a mask? Yeah, cleanser or toner? Cleanser. The only time I eat cheese is on like pizza. I will not eat it like in any other form. It's so, and you I used to not so even gross. eat it on your pizza. I used to not even eat it on pizza. Weirdo. I used to hate it. I think it's just the grossest thing in the world. Huh. Cheese is the best food. No, I guys, agree. she I like literally would eat a piece of pizza, but she would take <laughs> all of the cheese off. So she'd scrape the cheese off and just eat the pizza bread sauce with that. sauce. She'd eat that and it was a great meal. She like had a great time enjoying herself, munching on that. Psychopath. That honestly is like so sweet. Like that is tendencies. so gross. Like what? Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of foods that I didn't like when I was yeah. younger that I eat now. You never ate a vegetable in your life. <laughs> yeah, I know. Cause why would I eat a vegetable by choice? It doesn't taste as good as mac and cheese. That was bad. You know what I mean? Like now that I'm older, I understand that like, sometimes you just gotta eat things to be healthy and not because they taste good. You, you know can what I'm make them taste good. No, but obviously like, you're never gonna make like a vegetable taste as good as a piece of cake. You know, I, I don't really like cake that much though. You would eat cake for every meal like and just thoroughly enjoy that. Yeah. So would you rate the difficulty of this look? Nine out of 10. Really? So how do you think mine was? I mean, I feel like because it was really early on, you could definitely do better. Why would you dip a purple brush into the white? I thought that this was clean. Because it was one of your like earlier looks, like you could probably do better on it if you tried again now. But like, it still looks good. But I feel like your ones now are just like so like evolved. This uh, one, you know. That's why I think it's important to like take pictures because then you can always look back and like, yep. it's super important to like notice your progress. And yep. like be able to look back at your old stuff and like see how far you've come. This I is literally like a stick. Like, I don't this, like how this feels. I don't like how it looks. It's all over your teeth. You look disgusting. <laughs> Where? Your top teeth, you literally look disgusting. You look like trash. <laughs> you literally took a chomp out of this bottom lip. Like you're missing a whole section What do you now. mean like this? <laughs> Stop. Don't do that. Ew. <laughs> I can't look at it. Ew. Literally, you are disgusting. <laughs> let, let the artist work. Huh? You look like Kylie Jenner. So are we done? I would say yes. Okay guys, I think that is all for Maddie recreating my rainbow butterfly look. I mean, you can definitely tell what she was trying to do here, but 
I mean, I'd give it a solid, like, I'd give it a two. I'd give it a four, maybe. I could see a four. I mean, it's the thought that counts though. So if you guys enjoyed this video, please give us a big thumbs up down below. It really helps out my channel. And if you want to see more from me in the future, then hit that big red subscribe button down below and hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a brand new video, which I'm trying to get better at. I'm going to try and be uploading weekly now. So you definitely don't want to miss it. So hit that notification bell. And if you want to follow me on my social medias, they will all be linked in the description box down below. Mine too. I'll put Maddie's down there as well. <laughs> yeah, and if you want us to do this again and make this a series on my channel, then comment which one of my makeup looks you'd like to see her do next. Or comment more questions for us to answer. Also that. Until next time. Bye!